Iyo, eh warembo ni warembo ni wengi watu ni wawa. Ni wewe ulimpost eh? Sasa unachoma. Yeah yeah yeah, eh ilikuwa ilikuwa ka period fulani nilikuwa na ka family kitambo. Mm-hmm. Eh nikisema kana tufanye hivyo no is guy big deal but yes nilikuwa na family kitambo and then kama kawaida tu biashara wangu kanga pia ndoa unaelewa things happen watu outgrow yana nini nini. So mi ni kitu sikoni mimi fikiria naweza happen. Ushiona ni kama you, you knew it was, it was going to be forever. Yeah, I thought so. Actually knew eh. Ni zile then unaona ah ndio hii, una get eh. Eh ni kama tuseme ati siku moja nitaacha art ni kuwe ni kuwe mechanic. CEO ni una get eh. Yeah, it's it's, it's eh. then then it can happen and then it can hit. So yeah, by the kumbe hiki tu ni possible eh. So uh, the song actually was just me asking questions on actually where do where does love go? Yeah, ni kama kitambo kuna kawimbo kalimbwa where do broken hearts go? Mm-hmm. Where do broken hearts go? Do they find their way back home? Kitu kayo eh. Oni mtu pia alikuwa amekaa chini cuz honestly speaking. So nikaanza ku analyze love eh. And analyzing love as a man pia goes much deeper. Do you think do you know again I'm the one asking the questions. Do you know I think men love more than women? For me I think men are more jealous than women. No. <laughs> Men love more. Do you know why? <laughs> Finding a man to admit that he, he has a broken heart. Mm. <laughs> you get it? Eh? Mm. Yeah, so uh, it was that a period in the morning season kidogo kidogo. Ndio nikaanza kujiuliza hizo maswali like what happens eh? Unajua kuna zile mtu unajiuliza anga nini ingekuwa different? Nini 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 happen? Unaelewa how do how does it go this way without, without any signs? Hapo hapo penye unasema hebu tuambi what really happened? Ni wewe ulikosea ama ni yeye alikosea? Ah ah hiyo si ongelei. Ndio maana nimesema nimesema generally I had a family but ah. things just happened eh? Kulienda tu ku character development ili happen mwenye ali happenia mwingine hatujui. Ah ah Honestly speaking kuna mwenye ali happen ya mwingine oh. eh ni vile tu naweza sema mutual agreement not really time just happens like mnapata you have to grow each other yeah, i guess ni hivyo eh okay. but not not much details okay. yeah yeah umesikia nimejaribu my part amekataa kujibu <laughs> alafu nikaona tetema 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 yeah tetema Ah uh, sasa ilikuwa tu sasa ni kujaribu sasa kujivukisha boda. <laughs> ni kujaribu unajua sasa ndugu zetu hapa hapa East Africa hawa eh ndugu yetu wa 31st. Huyo mm-hmm. sijui kama umesikia ndugu yetu ameenda ku represent kule eh ako 31st years old ya. Yeah? Um tukasema tu kidogo uh, wana jaribu tu kitu pia ikotiz. Yeye ndiye sasa Eh what you yo ili kwa pia pressure <laughs> sikutangai ili kwa pia pressure eh ili kwa pia pressure kuna kongo na pia pressure di kongo mimi nadhani ni pombe peke yake hiyo <laughs> hiyo ya pombe ni pia pressure hiyo ilikuwa pia like hiyo ni ambwa fanya tetema tunakuaminia sasa nikasema ah hii ni juu 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 ju talent iko mm-hmm. why not and kai chapa pia iliweza mm-hmm. iliweza actually you tell you mm-hmm. strategy ilikuwa fit yangu ya ku make the wagidomo guy and now tito huyu anaimanga kikuyu mm-hmm. isifike si, mahali mm-hmm. eh lakini 2020 happened <laughs> yes i wanted to say that after that nikaona kaga pia one year nothing is happening there's no tito like okay what happened in one year haukuwa after tetema one year eh haya ukwasani wengi eh wase wengi mimi sikudanganya na kama kuna kitu mbaya ni ni, ni kutege, ukitegemea usanii eh unafikiri anga utakulia ku trend kujulikana sana unajua you you okolea you you okolea unazambia come we need to appear somewhere wase wa kuone tutakudunga this amount of money you know tunataka tu utufanye product placement kwa video yako uongele kitu fulani you know eh and now the problem with art art wanga zinavutana zote unapata anga msia na imba ndio ana act ndio ana kwa mc ndio ana you know ana vixen stream mahali zote zote zilikuwa zile vitu zote zilikuwa affected na, na corona 
Manze hawakt huwezi pigata voice over mahali huwezi enda kupiga kajingo jiota kampuni zimefungwa huwezi uh, MC hakuna events hata huwezi kupeleka ma public address system kwa ma events jo hakuna so uh, the reason i disappeared it was very intentional because um, hiyo time yako kangoma nimekuambia yako kenye tuna i actually am happy that we can laugh about it now eh hiyo time kwa minister we ilikuwa mapenzi ah ilikuwa kwa kwa chini kitapo yeah but yeah if i didn't want what what grow it to so um ni lile nga social media sana cuz hiyo ni time i'm telling you every person artist yote ama mtu yote anategemea art eh hii kila mtu alikuwa na stress and I, i would say most people were depressed yeah 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 cuz um wa hey hakuna kitu scary ka kusota mimi si jeju si jeju si jeju wa so ni do mingi hivyo sikudanganya hiyo time nilitulia manze hiyo time nilikuwa naishi kwa three bedroom on compound mm-hmm. peke yangu na dogi zangu and it's so, related to dogi to white yes alafu nilikuwa nimekoma na hiyo place juu nilikuwa nataka kufanya vitu nayo nilikuwa nataka kuweka studio huko nilikuwa nataka kushutia nje nilikuwa yani nilikuwa nataka kutumia hiyo place na vitu mingi sana nilikuwa nataka nilikuwa nataka kuendelea bado ku breed hizo madogi na nini so nimekoma na hiyo property eh bado nikipata kitu nalipa sengine waambia ngojeni kuna time ilifika baka akanihurumia akaniambia hii tito to understand ni kubaya wewe si worry size for like three months i didn't pay anything for like three months eh um So your period nilikuwa najishuku sana. Eh mtu unajua juu wangu kauko poa. So unaweza na kusema kitu kwa mtandao chome. So mimi niko avoid. Eh mimi hata sikuwa nataka hata kuproduce content. It's quite so direct. Eh that eh, to those days were hard man. Eh, they were hard. When I tell you they were hard, they were hard. But thank God by the funny thing eh. Eh mimi sikuwa na amini. I think people can really survive. Yeah, imagine. corona corona has taught us a lot. Man <laughs> tuko na survival mimi nakwambia nilikuwa na kaa hivi miss juu mili yangu next natoka wapi cuz juu uko na madogi bado zina kucheck zinafanya fanya hiyo yeah but sometimes cuz na nyokolea juu zinazana napata kuuza nini nini nilikuwa na nyokolea saa nyingine umekaa tu unafika place umeenda kusota mazeki ndizi kina mea usiki hiyo place ilikuwa ina ni nice For real ni funny. Mimi kwangu nilikuwa na chekanga. Kuna place nilikuwa nimepanda ngama nangu. Kitambo alafu nikaacha. Just as nilikuwa mingi excess alafu hiyo place nilikuwa naishi people do farming eh. So you can get those things for yani for free. So mimi kwa nafanya juu jupi na penda gardening. Huko nilikuwa nimepanda maua ni ni nini. Utaseme tu mimi ni mimi ni mse nimeumbwa na fani kwa na kwangu yani place yani mimi nimepanda tu maua niko na makuku zangu na ma, na magus. Ma. Family oriented. Yeah, yeah. I'm a home oriented I'd say. Yeah. So, mm-hmm. um, the reason I disappeared was mainly sikuwa na trust sana vile niko. Eh, sikuwa trust sana. Na sikuwa nataka like nitoe content inongea vitu direct. Eh, you know time kwanza nilikuwa nataka sana una meditate, manzi una plan. What if tutoke kwa hii situation? Eh, tukatoka how would you be ready for a situation kama hii tena hiyo time ilikuwa poa time poa ku meditate and i think it was nice kuondokea kiasi and then after that vile uli rudi sasa tukaanza kuona we 902 radio oh 902 radio ah uh, 902 radio was actually before before corona it was before but now if you check at your youtube after yeah. oh your gap yeah. uka come back na so 902 street radio oh 902 street radio um I had a dream ya kufanya job kwa radio. I had a dream ya kufanya job kwa radio. But um siko na jua mtu anafaa kuanza hapi because wasikia lazima kwanza wende ukafanye sijui ukasome journalism sijui nini nini nini. So uh, but I was hoping someday it itakuwa jia talent eh mm-hmm. uh, even to like uh, it expose um so I was I was trying out Eh uh, yes and I was doing it in my mother tongue again I love yes. my mother tongue. Yeah they take it ta bom. So uh ilikuwa kujaribu alafu when you are in charge na inatoka ni aifanya nyingine nikachapa nyingine fanya nyingine nikachapa hata zingine bado ziko nazo ni venye aziku nini aziku mahali tuko na record uh tukaluzizo hiyo hiyo nini hiyo data 
I want to ask kuna sahi kuna mse ni niliona tena alikuwa analia ati alikuwa alikuwa na act kwa TV gani um let me think was it yes i know him ni msao jina yake but alikuwa kwa nitaje yes 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 the real house of kangware yes so ebu niambi what is oni niliona hiyo nikashanga what is it that happens to artists Ebu ex can you give us ni nini nafanyika after we see them on TV wanapata do cuz real, real house ili ka for a long time si kitu ati lika for a year ama two you understand so after that tena tunaona anaanza kulia you know the likes of so many people hata siye peke yake we have so many people what really happens in this industry that like wana sota what happens i will tell you for sure yeah what to assume kukuona kwa TV was you una lipwa every single time una muona kwa tv watu assume hivyo also watu assume una lipangwa pesa mingi but that's not the case eh? kama wewe si main character wewe uko huko hivyo pesa ni kidogo sana but contract haise mangi atio kitu hizi show hiyo tena ama repeat kama mimi funny thing me i have over three years sijai shoot kitu kwa tv but please na stay wananipianga heshima sana mama mboga kwa tu ai rasta ah ndrako nile tulikuona sio nini i am telling you ni over three years hakuna actually i think almost four sija shoot kitu yote but bado naonekana kwa tv so what happens ni at eh, nikacha ni, ni kitu kama hiyo ini bebe ya kili i'll start living beyond my means unaelewa nikipata na msee fulani waka washap basi ni achie ka fifte na mdunga just because i'm in praise ni unaona nikienda kwa baesa kama ni kunywa mbili tatu hivi mimi ndo kununuliana sasa na maybe nikamshaandika kitu nimengoja three months na nimelipwa tu jana hata si pesa ya maana so what happens unapata nga umsani haizangi ku plan finances zake jua na amebeba wakili na fame Unaelewa also when you think when you're so famous you think that projects it come back to back hata utatoka kwa hiki kipindi kama umeingia ingine but that's not Kenya but I tell you I'm telling you Kenya kipindi ni zaisha hivi usawa watu wote by the way usawa wote so i would say the problem is not them i would say it's the it's the industry itself si sema ati wana mismanage hata pesa yao cause honestly speaking hata mtu ana mtu wa kawaida anafanya job yake ya kawaida akosangi kukunywa mbili tatu you know anafanyanga but you see sasa msanii yake kufanya the same same thing no jua flow yake si per month you lipangwa per season most of the time unalipwa per season so for you to wait, as you, as you wait for your next do unangocha like another like four months sangine even six before my season mbona nilikuwa na mtu akaniuliza why is it that wakiwa hapo mbona wasitumie si we see we see so many actors sometimes ama musicians wanajaribu we see like aziada yani yeye aliingia industry na akachukua wase na you know is it that these people are not hard working to look for corporates to look for something to do on youtube to to go and an extra mile ama cuz unasema shida si yao shida ni industry so what about that person ama hata kama ni actor don't you think you need to learn maybe editing ama ni shoot ama say hiyo when you're there you invest on equipment ndio hata wewe uenze uanze ku write your own skits or my your own things i would say for first time for first timers watu wameanza kupata hiyo glory for the first time hiyo eh? akili hizi kuja kwa hizi kam you akili hizi kuja like you never see yourself losing that uh, tv station or, or that nini that that tv program how onangi me honestly i intentionally stopped acting intentionally nilikuwa na acting kwa stage plays na naenda na figure zingine my extras kwa tv na kuna maros flani nilikuwa naitangwa kwa vanaki la tv stations eh? but i intentionally chose not to nikasema unless mimi ni kwe na production yangu mi mwenyewe na call shots najua how I will balance between the crew and the actors mm-hmm. history ingine high make sense let me tell you lives za watu zinaweza ruiniwa na tv mimi sikudanganyi mm-hmm. una kama wewe saa hizi utoke kwa tv u hit unaelewa mm-hmm. na ulipe mshande yako alafu iishe uta explainiaje landi na wenye ameku rank unaelewa uta okay. ujue kwa every function ya family yenu wana expect kufanya kitu kubwa Eh yeah, kuna kuna place unafaa kutoa do unajua merankiwa mpaka your whole clan itakuwa hata nania na kama ivona kama ah yeah basi sikutaweza hiyo sikuwezi shuka mat na confidence 
inabidi uingie na kaa haya manzi <laughs> ama na uba na ubaya sana kwanza na mimi umetoka far una get eh? i think art is overrated you know i think it's just overrated eh? so me for me particularly mimi niliamua tu kwanza naondoke acting um nifanye other passions zangu kama kuimba na kuimba inanipatia chance ya kufanya karaoke because i also mc now i can blend in host uh, mcing and singing na host karaoke because um, kuna kitu moja watu hajuangi Ujisikia barmaid mm-hmm. anakuanga therapist wa watu wengi sana. Mm-hmm. Eh anakuanga life saver. Let me tell you kuna mtu anakuanga amekujia whiskey yake ya last. Eh fikiria kumaliza maneno. Mm-hmm. Alafu maybe just anaulizwa eh mama mlimaliza mliacha ku at job kuliendaje ile time kiniambia ati kuna mtu aliwa kona na niona yakelewa. Mm-hmm. Anasema hata sijui bali niko nafikiria niwaambie hivi na hivi na What if you did this? Aya by the way mini mse i think given a chance ningekuwa psychologist mimi napenda kubonga na watu eh mimi napenda kubonga na watu sana napenda kumwasewa smile na napenda ku change lives za watu mm-hmm. so um as i'm hosting karaoke eh? mimi mtu wasi, wasi of all sorts wenye wanaletwa kwa club ama na bar na vitu different kuna mtu anakaa mjui wenyewe amelipwa tu anakuwa kupeleka pesa but kuna mtu amekaa mtu wa machungu kuna mtu amekaa akiwa broken kuna mtu wako undecided kuna mtu akikuwa ako depressed muache kesha huko maze mu have personal relationship na say nikakaa mkulan by the way say kujangi juu wako na do wasi wengine wa come to because ya kile kitu nawapea na mimi nika fall in love na kuhost karaoke. Yes, I wanted to come to that. Yeah. Sasa hosting. How do you do you know na mara uko nyeri, mara siji uko kikuyu, mara uko siji how do you manage all this? Wanasemanga eh, motivation, yani motivation yangu kutoka na passion, kutokana na passion. Eh kutokana na passion you ni kitu nika come fall in love nayo. And mostly you know music, music inaza change lives za watu. Music eh music to music to alone singing eh? and includes you singing as well wewe mwenyewe ndio imbe na hiyo sauti yako ya chura eh mnaweza mkaanzisha band mnaweza itachura squad so si lazima nikuwe na voice tu hata hii yangu inaenda unajua karaoke 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 is uh, simply singing badly yeah you can carry your own key jibambe you get eh? so ju ju hiyo passion si mind could travel mind could travel si mind hizo kuko anafanya job usiku mchana ndo anasikia kusinzia si mind ni kitu ni nimependa roho yangu yote eh ni kitu naweza fanya for free ni vile tu bills lazima zilipwe <laughs> ukweli eh hey, but then naona eh hey, karaoke we kwanza wamesema kuna mtu ali suggest kuna alikuwa anataka kumfanyia ka country ka cover ya country music fulani so hiyo lazima uta utachapa alafu jana nikaingia kwa instagram nikaona we hey karembo kingine we hiyo <coughs> eh warembo ni warembo ni wengi watu ni wao wa. ni wewe ulimpost eh sasa unachoma sasa unachoma ushaiweka public <laughs> eh lakini siongelei there's a reason hata sikuweka jina eh oh sawa so nimemaliza hiyo story <laughs> yani ni kusema mimi ni the search is over mimi niko sawa sasa So umesikia the search is over. I just ata ata sema mo. So wewe ujishikie. So anyway, so nilikuwa nataka unifanyie kakava. Kamoja. Moja uniko na fan wangu ali request ya country music. Ziko unaweza tufanyia ka Dolly Parton. Dolly Dolly ni mbanda. Ama ka Martin Law and Martin Lawrence. <laughs> Kenny Rogers. Kenny Rogers. <laughs> yes, ni my father. <laughs> yeah, you can do for us of us. And another good music as many as you can sasa flow ni yako. Nimekuachia jibambe na nimetoka. Mos 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 pole pole mos mos to azieda mos mos araka araka ina baraka mos 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 pole pole mos mos to azieda mos mos araka araka ina baraka. Mumesikia hiyo sauti? Hey, ni vile tu wako na mtu. 
Najua leo DM yangu itaja lakini poleni. <laughs> anyway, aja sema kama ako na mtu. So, um Tito. Um ebu give me your No, before you give me your last words. Are we seeing Tito are going back to music again? I wish this was possible to say heaven yeah. <laughs> But hell yeah. Like um Yes, I have been working. Uh in the studio. Um actually in in like a week or two kuna video naenda ku drop mm-hmm. and after your video kuna sasa one of those songs hizo zenye nilikuwa nimeandika kitambo sana zenye siku wanataka kufanya kama sina at least hata mtu anajua Tito ni nani. Mm-hmm. Uh, so yeah, a lot a lot a lot, lot. like I I owe it to myself like Eh you know you know wa shakila siku that sijafanya kitu yet. Ah okay so meskia so aki release your song mimi ni nani nitakuwa hapo I have to come the moment you release to hivi hiyo siku interview lazima wadau wasikie Tito is back. Anyway. <laughs> With a bang. Yeah. Anyway so tukimalizia you give me your final words kwa msanii mwenye nataka kujaribu ama just your final words to anyone out there trying to get into this industry All right um kitu mimi naambia artists ni at side hustle see distraction for real side hustle see distraction yeah even if ume unajua kudansa je wewe umeiva salsa unajua kuact eh unajua kuimba una get eh vitu kama hizo imanza it doesn't hurt kukuwa na kasaida hasa kukuwa na kabisa kako kaunozanga viatu ama vikoi or something eh? um, it will cushion you when art can't pay na art inatakanga patience sana before it start it it ianze kukulipa vizuri yani hiyo ni start nimekata kutoka na nguvu hivi <laughs> yeah uh, it doesn't hurt to have a kasaida hasa but never give up on art cause art will itakukula sana itakuwasha sana when you are old unaanza ku regret kuna vitu fulani ungefanya unge ukiwa when you, you had the energy na sasa hizi ufanye i've seen old people na sasa hizi ndo wameanza am refresh guitars you know si hizi taka mtu yote go back to that uh, so do your art do your art as much as you can go for free shows we piga show uh, usa painting zako cheap uh, funza street kids salsa you know fanya vitu zenye una feel ni kama azikulipi venye una feel una deserve lakini in the process kukifanya kitu kingine on the side until itakukushon until your time art yako itakulipa fiti hey asante sana aki thank you so much tito thank you so much for being uh, for being on my show <laughs> hey that has been my time my dear viewer aki thank you so much for being with us Um ebu eka po comment uh, comment like subscribe subscribe please to fix up um 1000 subscribers and also I'm going to pin his channel on the first comment so please 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 and then apo kwa Tito umesikia a lot more is coming from Tito so huko kwa Tito pia watu wangu twende huko we show some love to Tito amaniaje hapo no tunasemea tuaririe Bye bye guys I love you spread kindness wherever you are be kind to one another cheers <laughs>